I'm so excited today. I get to introduce a brand new Raquel Welch style. This one is called Bella Vita. It's in their new sheer luxury collection. There is a lot to unpack about this style. Coming up. I purchased this style at Wig Studio One. You can find it there too. Drop below this video, expand the description box. I'll attach a direct product link there. It'll be labeled Raquel Welch Bella Vita. If you click on that link, it'll take you out to the site. You can see all of the colors and the pricing in more detail. On this style, we invite you to shop at Wig Studio One. If you have any questions, please reach out to support at wigstudio1.com. And don't forget to visit the private Facebook group called the Wig Studio One Wig and Topper Support Group. All of those links are also below. So again, Let's Bella Vita, a mid-length, soft, femininely wave style with a nice lush density and a glamorous look. I was really hoping that Raquel Welch might have been able to see the prototype of this one before she passed earlier this year because I think she would absolutely love this style. Let's quickly examine the shaded sand though first. Uh, this RL1621 SS. I have seen uh, I have seen applications of this color before. I've liked each one. This one seems to be a little more highlighted than some applications, so we're going to talk about it. It's a medium sandy blonde. Now sand and honey are very similar in that they're very neutral. I like to call them sort of chameleon colors and they're neutral in tone and they really set the stage for these highlights which is a pale cool blonde. It's not a platinum. It looks rather to be creamy, a nice creamy cool blonde and all of that on a medium brown root. The rooting isn't overly dark and it blends very well and it transitions very well into this color. Before we move on to some of the specs and details on this wig style, I want to talk with you about this new collection, this sheer luxury collection. It features a new cap design called the Lux Light Cap. It's very lightweight, very realistic. I think you're absolutely going to love it. This piece is the Boudoir Glam in Shaded Iced sweet cream. I can't wait to show you this one as well. Be alert for the review. Now this cap is identical to the one here on the Bella Vita. So I want to talk with you about the Flex Light cap. We're going to go through this in great detail. So you're going to notice an extended lace front seamlessly into a left monofilament side part. However, um, around there are just some hand-tied panels covered up with a little bit of tool type material. <clears throat> it's very comfortable. And no matter where you part it though, I examined, you can see through to the illusion of scalp. It's just gonna be a little more obvious along those monofilament features. Now, you're gonna see a sizable ear tab. This gives amazing coverage. It's fully covered in a, in a polyurethane material and it is very grippy. This is not moving. I just can't believe the coverage on it. So the coverage is beautiful. It comes out to cover my own natural hairline, but not only that, it really does stay in place. I think you're really gonna appreciate that. Now, if you need to apply some adhesive to your wigs to keep them on for security, you can apply that directly to this polyurethane ear tab. You're gonna see that polyurethane also along this extended nape. Again, you can add your adhesives to that nape very easily. And again, it's not tacky, but it is grippy. It's super grippy on the skin. So I really like that. It's comfortable yet grippy and secure. And then you have your Velcro style adjusters, some integrated wefting in the back just for some extra support, and then hand tied panels all around. What you need to know about these caps is that they are made for that average to petite average circumference. All five of these styles are made in this way. I can tell you from trying both of these on that they do fit me average. I still had to cinch them in considerably to accommodate my petite average circumference. I'm 21 and a quarter inches all the way around, so take that for what it's worth, I would have no idea if it would stretch up to a large or not. So it's completely hand tied, as you've seen through the cap here that I showed you. It's very lightweight. I don't even know that it's on. I made a slight adjustment 
and we are good to go. Um, you can definitely feel the luxury of this brand new cap. Bella Vita has about a 10 and a half inch front piece here. That front layer about 10 and a half inches overall, and I did not measure, I'm just kind of guessing here at around 13 to 14 inches if it's stretched out a bit. You're going to see that it is a softly waved style. So it looks like big barrel curls have just been mildly raked through with fingers and it delivers a beautiful lush layering appeal and a bouncy bodyful movement. It's just delightful, isn't it? It has a lush density. This is made from the True to Life Fiber by Raquel Welch. It is heat friendly. All five of the styles in the new Sheer uh, Luxury Collection this year are made from this heat friendly fiber. Each one of these fibers is soft and velvety to the touch. You can use your heat tools on it. You can add a little more curl. You could straighten it out in places. I don't think I want to do anything at all. It just fell into place for me. I absolutely adore it. But just be aware that the density is that typical glamorous Raquel Welch style density. So let's get up close on this lace front as I have it applied. Everything you love about a Raquel Welch lace front uh, is going to be present here. It's a beautiful extended lace front through the ear tab, no visible seams. It's made from a nice lightweight soft material with a fine grid. They do give the highlight right up to that lace front. Nice softened look there. And then if you wanna part it along the monofilament, you're definitely gonna get the illusion of scalp. However, I experimented and even if you wanna part it a little off of that monofilament, these are still hand-tied panels. There's no wefts. So you can certainly get the effectiveness of a full monofilament top and hand-tied hand -tied wig on this style. So you're not gonna see any permatees on this style. It's uh, hand-tied panels with lots of cluster knotting in the process. So you're not gonna really see any permatease at all. The volume that you get is going to come from this beautiful body and density and curl. I'll show you more of what this can do in the styling segment. You'll learn right along with me. But what I'm sensing here is that this could really be just fluffed out a little bit for a nice glamorous appeal. That's what this nice lush density full of body will do for you. But if you want it similar to what you see in the product photos, I think it's just been just sort of smoothed over with the fingers a little bit. Now, you know me, I just like to fluff it out slightly, but you can see how easily you can shrink that profile and wear it in a little more casual look. So I think you would absolutely love this style if you enjoy the legacy Raquel Welch with this glamorous, lush density and volume. The soft curl, it's going to be a little bit longer compared to the, let's say, editor's pick. It's a really nice addition. And this cap, you have to really experience uh, the luxury of this cap. I am quite pleased with the pieces that I have in this collection so far. So let's go ahead. So let's go ahead and try with glasses. Glasses fit nicely and neatly between the ear and the ear tab. Aren't these sunshades really pretty? Something Raquel Welch herself might have worn. Very comfortable with glasses. So I'm just gonna, I don't know what I'm gonna do yet, but I am gonna toss this around, get you familiar with the density, the movement. Uh, the opportunities and options that you're going to have for styling. Everybody have a great day. Enjoy this new collection. See you soon.